What's going on guys? Floppy Flubber back at you with another video. So in this video, I'm going to be doing the Coke and Mentos challenge. But wait! I don't want to do it! Where'd you come from? Under uh, the table. Uh, okay. Well, I am here joined by G-Man in this video. And we are going to... Basically, we're going to test out which Mentos, if you put Diet Coke, basically what happens if you don't know, if you put a Mento in Diet Coke, then it'll explode. Not a big explosion, but like, it'll come out. And we're going to see which Mento works the best. It's either fruit or mint Mentos. We it's also just have gum. Mentos gum. Yes, Mentos gum. We don't think it'll work, but you know, whatever. Might as well give it a try. So, before we get into this video, I would, my shout out goes to Kobe. Kobe, thank you. Um, for he, I passed by him uh, several times a couple days ago, and every single time I passed by him, he would yell, Floppy Flipper, I'm your biggest fan. So, thank you, Kobe, and thank you, everybody who is part of Floppy Army. And if you're not, then please join Floppy Army by subscribing and turning on post notifications and dropping a like on this video. And if you would, please do comment down below, hashtag Floppy Army, so that I can know you're part of Floppy Army, and you'll most likely get a shout-out in the next video. So without any further ado, let's go. Hey, guys. I'm, we're back. So we're outside, and we're going to be doing the Coke and Mentos Challenge, as you already know. So Floppy is going to put the mint Mentos into this Diet Coke, mint. and I will put the fruit Mentos into this Diet Coke. We're going to see which one has the better reaction. Personally, I think the mint Mentos is going to have a better reaction. What do you think? Bobby? I think the mint Mentos is going to have a better reaction because, one, I'm doing pouring it. I'm joking. That has nothing. But mint probably has a stronger taste, which means, I don't know, more chemicals in it? I don't know. So we're just going to take one of them, and we're going to do it in three, two, one. I'm going to... Okay. So obviously, this one's still going, and this one is stopping. I the men did the bigger reaction. Okay. So we were right, and now. Well, I don't know. This one's still going. I say you can use either if you really want to. They both work. That was still going. Okay, maybe they're even actually. But now let's try the Mentos gum. So I, uh, G Man, what do you think will happen? Um, I don't think the Mentos gum will do anything. Yeah, I think it'll just sit there. I mean, it kind of looks like uh, a mento. Just go ahead and drop it in, Floppy. Oh, oh my gosh, it actually did it. Okay. Wow. Well, if you need the, if you can't find mentos, mentos gum is always. I mean, it's not as good, but it's it is better than I thought it was. It's still going. I'm gonna drop another in there. Oh, yep. Mentos gum works just as good as Mentos do. So for this next thing, uh, G-Man and I are both going to pour a little bit of uh, Diet Coke in our mouth, and then we're going to put a mint Mento, no, mint, well, which one works better? Well, they both work the same. I'll put it in a fruit, I'll put it in a mint, and we'll see what's going to happen. I'm, I've heard of videos like this, but I've never actually seen one, so I'm actually kind of scared. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm ready to do it. Let me get a little kitty. I am. I really don't want to do this. Okay. Do you mean you're ready for this? No. Hold on, hold on. I still can't believe that gum worked. I mean, gum is way okay. different than actual candy. Let me just go ahead and clarify. We're going to pour the Diet Coke in, and then we're going to drop the mento. Yes. So, in three, two, one. Work. 
that was so weird. I mean, you just felt it bubbling. Like, at first, I dropped it in three seconds. For three seconds, I didn't feel anything. I'm like, this isn't going to work. And then, like, after that, it started to flow. I'm like, oh, it's working. I'm probably going to go back and uh, slow-mo that to uh, show y'all. Because immediately it happened. So that was fun. So now I'm going to do the same exact same thing with the gum. You and me are both going to do it. This was not planned, by the way. So here you go. I'll get the gum. Get your coke. Okay. Coke. Okay. In three, two, one. <laughs> that did not work at all. I was like, waiting for it to happen, and absolutely nothing happened. Mine sort of worked. So we're just going to do one more experiment before we leave. I'm going to shake up a bottle of Diet Coke really well, and then I'm going to slowly take the cap off. Let's see if that loses more Diet Coke than putting a Mento in it. So go ahead and shake that up, Garrett, and then we'll take a mint Mento. Okay, just shake that up. Shake, no, shake, just keep on shaking it. Okay, yeah, that seems solid, okay? That's, okay, so slowly take the cap off in three, two, one. Holy moly! Okay, let's see how much Diet Coke that lost. About down to here. Here, move, move it closer to the camera. About down to here, and this is still going. It's kind of stopped. Let's see if I, nope, still going. You can see... You can see the Mento pushing up fizz through here. That's pretty cool. Wait, wait, wait. What happens if I put the cap? Put the cap on. Wait, I'm about to put the cap on and shake it. Okay. I'm going to put it in another Over bit. here, I'm going to go ahead and start shaking this Diet Coke again. I don't think it works if you shake it twice. Well, that's what we're fixing to find out. Okay. okay, so it's very pressurized. I want to put it the ground. Okay, yep. Yeah, that made more come out. Now let's try mint. Uh, the the new the new hit flavor Diet Coke Mint Minto. Oh, those two do not go well together. No. Nope. So thank you for watching, and until next time. Oh my gosh. Stay fucked. Hey, he got it. <laughs>